It's time. It's finally time for the new anti-cheat to come to Roblox. I know that we have been anticipating this since forever. Like genuinely, I don't know if this is just my memory being horrible or if it really has been this long, but I just, I cannot remember for the life of me the first time that I talked about this new anti-cheat because I know that I made a video about it the second we found out that it was like in the works. But regardless, none of that matters anymore because it's actually been released and this time for real. We even had confirmation from Creekcraft and I feel like like if you have been in the Roblox community for some time you know that Creekcraft announcing something is how you know that something is happening for real. So hello there please make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe if you haven't already done so. And very quickly please join my discord server the invite code is Chloe Games and there is a link in the pinned comment. Okay on top of the anti-cheat there has been like a bunch of new improvements to Roblox and I feel like this is going to end up being one of the coolest things because finally they are boosting the performance of Roblox, basically. So Roblox has released a brand new 64-bit desktop client. It also comes with Bifron's new anti-cheat known as Hyperion. With the launch of a 64-bit client, games will also receive small performance boosts around 1-3% to and in certain situations could be 50%. What are your thoughts? So the new anti-cheat is basically like the main thing about this entire thing. We have been talking about this since forever. Whether it's most of the Roblox community talking about how this is is finally gonna stop Roblox hackers or even the Roblox exploiters themselves just talking about how this is gonna ruin their lives we have been anticipating the release of the new anti-cheat forever because this is actually Roblox has never had anything like this before it was basically developers were left fending for themselves sometimes Roblox might ban the exploiters and I guess that's as far as that would go but ultimately it was near impossible to completely avoid exploiters inside of your game like people were making their own anti-cheats which you know they weren't the best because it was pretty much all they could do inside of Roblox Studio but now Roblox itself as a platform as a client has its own anti-cheat plus the added bonus of the teeny tiny performance boosts I feel like this is gonna end up being pretty cool so like right now when you are opening Roblox and you are in task manager you can see that it's gonna say like Roblox client and then it's either gonna say 32-bit or 64-bit for you if it says 64-bit that means that you have all of this new cool stuff you have the little performance performance boosts, you have the new anti-cheat, basically the brand new improved Roblox, the 64-bit version. If you still have 32-bit, you will eventually get 64-bit, but that also means that I think you don't have the anti-cheat yet, you don't have the cool little performance boosts, but you will eventually, so I guess just wait it out. The funniest part about the new anti-cheat being released is that, like, I found out about this from the RTC. Basically, they said with the introduction of Bifron into Roblox's 64-bit client, an exploiting group has released a script injector to iOS devices. iOS currently doesn't have any installed anti-cheat measurements. Usage of such software may potentially be harmful. So pretty much what they are saying is that Roblox exploiters, they, you know, obviously cannot exploit with the new anti-cheat on PC now. So somehow, like I've never seen this before, I didn't even think it was possible to exploit on mobile, but they created an exploiting program to be able to exploit on Roblox mobile. Like, I don't even have words for this. I, I, that, that sounds insane to me. And obviously I will never ever condone exploiting on Roblox. That goes without saying, but it kind of feels like, you know, where there's a will, there's a way. Cause these people had their PC exploits taken away. They, they made an exploiting program on mobile. Like how, why, how? Yeah, that's where this one ends. We have a new 64 bit version of the desktop client. We have a new anti-cheat on Roblox. We have performance boosts, all good things. All very very, very positive things. Finally, we have a good update that pretty much no one can complain about. But anyway, I'm gonna think of the new anti-cheat finally coming to Roblox. It's been a long time coming. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.